One of the realities about our tears of sadness is that they are often accompanied by feelings of great loneliness. Uh, it, may, it may feel like our tears are just unseen. It may feel like our heartache and our sorrow go completely unnoticed. Nobody cares and nobody knows that we're hurting. And, and, and maybe it feels like this too. And you know what? Even if they did know, it wouldn't matter to anybody anyhow. You've had moments like that, right? Yeah. Yeah. Here I am hurting and nobody gives a rip. I say that uh, uh, pretty regularly to the clerk at the grocery store. And she, uh, <laughs> then she hands me my change and runs in the other direction. In the Bible, though, we actually find that our sadness matters to God. Yeah, we matter to God. Our sorrow really does matter to God. In Psalm chapter 56, verse 8, in part of his prayer to God, the psalmist proclaims this. This is to God. You, God, you keep track of all my sorrows. You have collected all my tears in your bottle. Still in the text, you, to God, you, God, you have recorded each one in your book. Here, think about this with me. In other words, every single tear you have ever cried is noticed by God. God knows about it. Oh, yeah, yeah. There is a divine record that is maintained. You're not alone. You're not alone after all. <laughs> God sees, God knows, and God loves you.